right this is the control as you can see it's only got four buttons that one there would normally be a power button but it ain't got it uh, I can't find a way of getting into the advanced settings stroke secret menu to change the fuel pump or the air ratio and nobody on YouTube has seen a remote like this one right, this is the heat uh, the cover that it goes in stripped down to the basics fuel tank fuel filter fuel pump from the fuel pump underneath into the heater like right, this I will be putting I will be bolting that to the wall there so that I will be able to bolt the pump as low as it'll go or above the heater right, to get underneath exhaust fuel in air intake wiring loom this wire here is the remote control wire it goes into the loom the other wire the other wire there is a red and a black one goes into the fuse that's the power wire right I've tried it with that exhaust but I've also had it with oh no, that exhaust the little one is only 10 inch long and it still kicked out a smoke I'll go in and show you where the wire diagram is. Sorry, forgot to mention that goes through the wall over about a foot and then up into the bedroom. That piece there is only one meter long. That is what creates the recirculating system. It goes from there through out the other end over there into the house, through the house, back around so it's continually circulating. Right, power, socket, underneath the floor, over, up inside the cupboard to the transformer that's set at 12.4, uh, 12.8 sorry, and it goes back down, over, into the heat away you've just seen, the controller goes from in the living room, straight down, underneath, so basically, the white wire there goes down under the floorboards up to there back down under the floorboards out to the heater the controller that goes from here straight down under the floorboards and out to the heater and that's how my system is set up <laughs> 